Well, it's a good thing the eclipse is still a few days away because we wouldn't want the kind of weather that we have right now going into Monday. Still a chill out there for your Friday. And yes, we're still looking at showers of rain and wet snow, wintry showers, I guess you could say. As we head into tonight, some of those mixed showers along the Lake Plain and into the hills, another couple of inches of snow. You're waking up here on this Friday morning to uh, some of that snow on the ground, especially into places like Genesee County, uh, out towards Batavia Way. And as we work our way into the weekend, yes, it will be an unsettled start, but it will be a nice finish. It's all about how you finish, right? And it looks like we will find some sunshine for the day on Sunday. So we've got uh, eclipse day here in our medium range computer model guidance and all indications right now, according to the American model, suggest at least some mid and high level cloud cover here uh, for uh, the day on Monday for Monday afternoon, right around totality. Our European computer model here is a little bit more optimistic, suggesting some clearing coming in uh, from the West around the time of totality. So we're going to have to wait and see how this all shakes out. One thing is for sure it is going to be on the mild side. And as we get a little bit closer into uh, Saturday and Sunday, might actually be able to fine tune this forecast down to the hour in terms of cloud cover. Hour by hour we go here for now. Showers of rain mixed with wet snow. April has decided that it's Halloween because it's wearing its February mask with temperatures near 40 degrees. Best chance for seeing some of these scattered showers of both rain and wet snow probably midday and then again later tonight as it's a case of the low that just won't go. Keeps spinning and twirling like a big old top nor'easter off the coast. There's the system that brings some of that mid and high level cloud cover to our sky heading into Monday. As we look at the snowfall tallies again, a few inches of sugary wet snow, not out of the question all the way into Saturday, Sunday, we're finally going to see some sunshine around here. 32 degrees right now. Some of those wet flakes flying. It feels like 25. Feels like 20 in Jamestown here this morning. 18 in Wellsville. So you still have to bundle up. Low pressure in the upper atmosphere is still twirling. That's the parent low, the nor'easter off the coast. And again, the influence is off the lake, generating some of these flakes that will still be flying in through this morning, scattered about. And uh, when temperatures do get above freezing this afternoon, we should see some of those flakes mixing with some raindrops. We should find high temperatures into the low 40s with a northwesterly breeze holding onto the clouds tonight and some of those scattered flurries. Saturday is pretty cloudy and again, some more flurries will fly into the western and central southern tier. Finally, once we get towards Sunday and drier air comes in, we'll see some sunshine developing and temperatures are back close to 50. So again, the forecast for today, 42 is your top temp with mixed showers and flakes. Uh, tonight, a couple of inches of snow in the hills. There's your super seven day forecast. Again, Sunday is your pick weekend day, at least some mid and high level clouds, but a mild one for eclipse day and it's even milder going forward. Looks like maybe we've finally shaken off winter with temperatures in the mid 60s on Tuesday.